I don't know what to say. Just roll the intro. The Pack Vagan is a tier 2 armored car that is also known for having a very nice full name. Being. Schwerer Panzerspielwagen 7,5 cm Sonderkraftfahrzeug 234 4 Panzerabwehrkanonwagen. Thanks Mike Goes Boom for pronouncing the name. Now on to actual informative part. This car sits at a battle rating of 3.0. It doesn't have much armor, but it has great guns. The point of getting this vehicle is to taste its speed and its superior gun. So what is the main gun? It is the middle size 75mm German gun, which can penetrate up to 151mm of enemy steel, even more when versus in casted steel. It can destroy almost any enemy tank it meets at its tier, from great distance. That is the difference. The cannon can destroy vehicles from a distance. From the St. Glorianus Churchill to the Pravda KV-1. You will meet no tank that would refuse to let shells fired by this cannon in. It fires a shell per around 7 seconds, making it slower than the Shamans and the British. But what you have is the capability to destroy them before them hitting you. Do learn how to range find. It surely helps in your survivability. Treat it like any other rope and top tank destroyer, except it is mounted on a fast BMV. It can reach speeds up to 50 km per hour on flat grounds, and around 25 km per hour off-roading, and only in some rough terrain will you get down to 6 km per hour. It has a relatively small turning circle. The circle's diameter is around the length of the car, which means you can turn around in urban areas and escape from the enemy, with the help of its fast reverse speed which was as fast as going forward, plus the fact that the wheel steers fully from one side to another within 2 seconds. Before a battle, bring as much APCBC as you want, because you will get ammo racked, no matter where you place your ammo, and a little bit of APCR just in case. Never bring HE or HE80 cause they suck at destroying enemy vehicles, even when versus in lightly armored vehicle as you should use your machine gun mount. In a battle, get into position as quickly as you can with your speed, switch positions after destroying a few tanks as you can be destroyed by literally anything with its paper thin armor. Do not stay in the open, as you will pretty much get deleted quickly, when you are getting shot, reverse, and try to flank the enemy. In normal circumstances, the enemy will ignore you, thinking that you are the two, three, for with a shorter barrel, but it turns out the shell moving at them was launched from a cannon which was almost twice the length they had originally expected. If you see an enemy that doesn't see you, you get into position quickly and shoot at him as soon as the gun and chassis stabilize, so before they can turn their turrets they are already dead and move your position to at least 100 meters from the spot you killed it, since the enemy will get salty thinking that you are a pay to win and try to get revenge with CAS, but turns out that they can't find you and they gave up searching for you. For modifications, get the mark of distinction as soon as possible. For crew skills, take tank driving so you can drift more often, targeting and ranger finding so you can be a more efficient tank destroyer. Weapon reloading to destroy more enemy tank within seconds. Field repair as a lot of your component is very destructible along with your weak armor. Vitality to increase your chances of survivability. And leadership to increase your overall combat effectiveness. Now go out there and destroy the enemy with your big guns and quality sound systems.